Hey, what's going on guys? It's Combo here, and today I'm bringing you guys a nice little free-for-all ma match here on the map, Hanoi. I'll be using my newly acquired gold PSG-1, and uh, I'll be using the classic controller if you haven't noticed already from my Claymore fa fail that I just set there. But um, I'll be using the classic controller for the main reason that sniping with the CCP is 10 times easier with than with the Wiimote, in my opinion. So that's why I decided to use the CCP for this. So uh, I managed to pull off a pretty decent score. I really like this gold PSG-1. I'll get into that a bit. And uh, if you guys, uh, let me let me tell you something right off the bat here. Um, just in case some of you uh, may or may not know, uh, I haven't posted a video in about a week or five or six days or whatever. And that's kind of long for me, especially uh, I tend to post videos every once, every every day or every other day. Uh, that's what I usually do and that's what I tend to do. And it, it doesn't really interfere with doing homework or anything like that. But um, basically, it's weird how it happens, but every two or three or three or four months, um, I, there's a couple days in a row that just, uh, I feel no happiness or anything. I just, in like a really deep, like state of depression. I don't know if it's a disease or a disorder or something, but, um, it's just every, every once in a while, like three months, I'll just feel like no happiness at all. Like there's no point in living. That's basically, um, how I feel. It's weird how it works out, but, uh, that's what happened. Um, I just, you know, it, it's not really anything happening like in life that makes you depressed, but it just... Like as soon as you wake up, you know, um, you know it's gonna be a a bad day, and you know it. Nothing can make you. Ha nothing can make me like happy during those days. Um, not even if a guy like came up and uh, you know said you want a machinima contract or a million dollars or anything like that. Um, I wouldn't even be happy. I would. I would just. You know, it's it's weird how it works out, but that's basically what happened to me those days. Um, I was even uh, you know thinking about completely stopping this but I I don't know it's just uh, you think differently um, during those times and I don't know how how it worked out but um, basically that's what's been going on it's it's a lot better now it's just a couple days and then it's back to normal but um, that's basically why I haven't posted a video I, I wanted to take a break from this a little bit um, it's not that it was uh, not fun to make these videos I still have a bunch of fun making these videos and getting these gameplays for you guys and stuff like that, and you know, uh, talking to my subscribers and stuff. It's a really fun experience. YouTube is, so uh, it's it's not that I wanted to stop YouTube. It's just that I felt, uh, you know, I was just really depressed for those those couple days. And uh, for the future reference, if it ever if I ever go a week or two without posting a video, you know why it is. It's because of uh, that depression state or whatever. I don't know what it is, but it's really weird how it works out. So. Um, Anyway guys, I'm using my gold PSG-1 here. So basically, I just wanted to cover a little bit of tips here on this gold PSG-1 that I have here carrying around. Um, uh, as you guys know, it's a sniper rifle, and uh, in my opinion, this gun is a lot better than the L96. I'll get into that a little bit. Uh, but first off, I just wanted to let you guys know that they haven't patched this on Wii yet, but they have on the Xbox and PS3 that if you put any attachment on uh, onto this gun here, you will, get a, you will still get a one-shot kill to the upper body and stomach. Now basically they haven't patched it in Wii, uh, meaning that the only time you'll get a one shot kill to the upper body and stomach is when you have no attachment on it. And uh, unfortunately they haven't patched it like I said, but in PS3 and Xbox, um, it's if you put any attachment on it other than the silencer, if they even have a silencer for this gun, I don't know. Um, but if you, it'll, it'll still be a one shot kill even if you are using like extended mags or you know an ACOG or whatever. But they haven't patched it on Wii, so if you're going to use this gun, definitely don't put an attachment on it. Um, I would recommend using Scavenger Pro because you only get 15 bullets um, other than the initial 5 in the chamber so or in the uh, clip. So um, that's what I would definitely suggest to you guys is to use no attachment. Um, it makes the gun a lot better and it uh, definitely will get you more kills. So basically guys, um, the L96 is kind of... Uh, I don't really like that gun, especially using this classic controller. And what I would suggest basically to you guys is to use this gun. If you haven't used it already, try it out. It is definitely worth trying and is a lot better than the L96 in my opinion. It doesn't have to be cocked. You can easily, you know, uh, control the recoil there. As you can see, even if you shoot it once and miss, it, it goes right back to the, the target that you're aiming at within a half a second, not even. So the L96 has bigger idle sway too, I believe, which means when you're looking down the, the scope regularly and you're not holding your breath to steady the aim, um, it, it sways more. It sways more than the, the PSG-1. It, it, it seems that way. I'm not sure if it, it uh, actually has the uh, bigger idle sway, but it definitely seems that way. And I just think the PSG-1 is an overall better weapon. And I, and I believe that if they do 
uh, eventually patch this uh, so that the you know you can put extended mags on it and ACOG and it'll still be a one shot kill to the upper body and stuff then I definitely think it will be even more of a better weapon in my opinion so as you see here I would not have uh, definitely not have pulled this score off if I was using the Wiimote which is my uh, you know thinking behind using the classic controller so um, that's basically why I used it um, it's really it's a lot easier to know aim down the scope and wherever your uh, you know the middle of the crosshairs where is where you'll aim and kind of I find that unreliable when using the Wii remote is that when you when you aim um, where your dot is it kind of doesn't go there all the time it's definitely a lot easier to quick scope and uh, you know find your target and follow him easier so that's why I use the CCP and I would suggest if you guys have one you get you get better with the CCP and uh, I definitely suggest using it when you're sniping because it makes things a lot easier so uh, like I said I wouldn't have got pulled off this such a score um, if I was using the, the Wiimote obviously so so one more tip like I said basically guys is uh, if you're gonna use this gun and you want it to be a one shot kill to the stomach and upper body uh, don't put an attachment on it and definitely use scavenger pro because if you are using this gun without any attachment you will only get 15 bullets to reload it and uh, especially in a game type like free for all you're gonna run out of bullets uh, quickly so uh, use scavenger pro and you'll be set with this gun it's, it's definitely a lot better than the L96 in my opinion so anyway guys uh, I know I still have to get you that L96 gold gameplay um, I don't think me and my friend are gonna do that thing anymore but um, hopefully maybe I'll do it with uh, chaos or anyone who has an Xbox or something so um, basically that's about it guys I'm on spring break this week so I'm gonna be making a lot of videos hopefully and I'm gonna hopefully get my first uh, tips and tricks series up I don't know what I'm gonna call it yet but it's basically gonna be on how to set a claymore and it sounds really obvious but I'll show you guys what it's like and stuff it's a pretty cool series and I hope you guys will enjoy it so um, hopefully I'll get that up it takes a lot of editing and time so I'll get that up this this week uh, no school so I'm pretty happy about that and anyway, guys, I hope you understand why I haven't posted a video in a while. Um, so that's about it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video, and please like it. It definitely helps a lot. And I'll see you all later.